Okay, so what we're doing right now is we're building the footing. We're just framing it up, cribbing it up. And uh, it's a 20 inch wide by eight inch thick uh, concrete. But you said six. No, you said six. <laughs> I I'm said glad eight. glad you're here. <laughs> yeah. Eight is better than six. Yeah. More is better. So okay. I'm told, yeah. So I'm just measuring six inches off the outside pin. Then I nail my boards together, straighten them out, and peg them up, but the pegs aren't here yet. So. I'm just reading the blueprint so I can figure out uh, where the house exactly is going to sit. And the side wall is 38 foot 6 long. After this is cured, tomorrow morning, they'll start uh, standing panels on it. So those are the big things that come in and they hoist those in like those. Yeah, they come in cages. Big, yeah. They're two foot by nine foot panels. Yeah, that's also fun. And uh, then once you set that all up, then you pour concrete yeah, in that. Yeah, so the cribbing means like they're putting together the forms all around where they're gonna pour the concrete into those walls. The foundation is the crib. These pieces of sticks are a little heavier than I Imagine them, maybe I'm just out of shape. Here I always put the uh, sump pump, try to put it in the mechanical room where it's not in the way of everything else. Okay, so now that we have part of the, the cribbing done, we're gonna take off. What's gonna happen later on is we're going to finish doing the perimeter of this house. We have the vacuum truck coming that's gonna take out the rest of this water. And then immediately after that, we're gonna bring in the concrete. The concrete's gonna be poured all around inside these forms. Then we're gonna leave that sit for a couple of days for that to get nice and hard. And then we'll be back another time to come and do the rest. Huh? Did you miss this, Dale? I do miss that. <laughs>